Hi guys, in today's video I wanted to show you how I applied a temporary backsplash on my kitchen wall by using $5 contact paper that I found at Walmart. First I'm going to prep the walls by cleaning them and getting all this stuff out of the way. So let's go ahead and get started. Select the angle you need to make a triangle, but it says it's wrong.
you guys this is a pain in the ass. Looks good. Not too bad for a $5 sticker. But steps down here that I'm going to show you guys but I don't really care about because my microwave's going right here. So it's going to cover it all up. But that's a tedious job I tell ya. Oops. But this is only, and you can tell, like it doesn't match up. And that's okay. Like I said, my microwave will be here. So I'm not too worried about it. But it does look nice behind everything and from a distance and stuff and i was lucky enough to get this side to match up perfectly you can't tell at all where the seam is and it's literally like right here but you can't see it because i match it up so well but i wasn't so lucky on the other side and i just gave up trying to get it matched so but it's okay my grave's going there so it's not that big of a deal we got this far now we're gonna do back there behind the sink and then behind this microwave um i'm gonna move the microwave i don't have very much counter space and i put the microwave back up there to make something um warm something up earlier so we're gonna get that done and um see how quickly we can do it Okay, so I'm just about finished and it's now like eight o'clock at night and the kitchen is a mess, So, but I'm still gonna show you guys the before and after. Um, well, you've already seen the before, but I wanna show you the finished product. So um, I've finished a couple of pieces without filming just because the kids were going crazy. I had to feed them dinner. Um, but the textured wall, um, makes it a little bit difficult to use this peel and stick um, laminate, if that's even the right, peel and stick backsplash, I don't know what you'd call it, but, so it makes it a little bit difficult because um, it's textured, so it's not um, sticking to it as well as it would if it were a smooth surface, but it's on there and I'm happy with it. We don't plan on being in this house too much longer because it's too small for our family. I've mentioned in my other videos that we do live in a small home um, and we are planning on moving. But for now, it's just nice to kind of spruce things up for the time being, although we have been here for quite some time and I'm just now um, having these um, thoughts of wanting to do this only because I've seen a few YouTube videos. So uh, Freddie, my fiance, he painted the living room. You can see back there, it's like a really pretty blue it's like a really soft blue um, during the day it kind of looks like a really light gray but our walls were really dingy and dirty it's a uh, been a long time since they've been freshened up so it looks really nice and we have that um, LED lights behind the TV and everything so it looks good it looks clean and so I kind of wanted to do something to add on to that with the kitchen so our cabinets are really old and they're just the wood they're peeling and they just need something. So I'm gonna start that this week and I'm super excited. So I'll make a video of that separately, but I just want to turn you guys around and show you so far, I just have a teeny tiny little piece that I run short on. So I'm trying to take my time and match it up because it is one of the, um, it's one of the areas that you'll see a lot. Whoops. So I'm gonna try and take my time and find a piece and you can see I've been trying to fit it together like a little puzzle here but um, I want to take my time and find it so that way it will fit in there perfectly and you won't see any of the seams or anything so I'm gonna take you along down this way and you cannot even tell but right here I had to match it up as well because I was a little bit short but it's nice because on this whole side you cannot tell 
you know, that any of the pieces are um, split up. So this is all one piece, as you guys saw me do in the video. But then I think it was just this little tiny border in the back of the sink that I did not film. So I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. I really like how it came out so far. Um, it's basically just a sticker, so you know it's not going to last that long. Um, but I am excited for how it looks right now. And like I said, I made dinner. I just made some spaghetti, so that's what you see there. But I really like. Don't pay attention to the my nails for one. But don't pay attention to the um, above the oven. It's also old, and everything in this home is really old. But you know we've made it work for this long. And then also on this side, I think I mentioned earlier, but there's a seam here and I got lucky and found uh, where it kind of lined up and you cannot tell that there is a split there either. And I'm sorry if you hear my son screaming in the background, he's playing a game on his Xbox with his friends. So the only parts that did not match up was right here. And you can tell it's, you know, not perfect, but I didn't mind because the microwave is right there. So. That's not a big deal. Here's what we have so far, and I'll show you when I get that little piece filled in if I find the matching puzzle piece. Yay! There's Daddy and Brother! Yay! And Papa! Yay! Here I was going to take off all of the doors and the hardware because I had planned on applying some solid white contact paper and trying to turn all of our cabinets white without having to paint them. Um, I took all the doors off and all the hardware and then decided not to do it, but I had to include this clip because here you'll see I dropped this cabinet right on my toe and it hurt really bad. What happened? <sighs> oh, it fell on my butt. What happened? It fell on my butt. It fell on my It's okay. Mommy's fine. Yeah. Mommy, bye. Ow. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be a good bruise. That's gonna be a good bruise, is it? Oh, I can't even move my whole foot. Owie, owie, owie. There you go. There you go. Much better. 